that would have never worked two years ago. Right. So you're definitely right about that. Sometimes a no is preparation. I like that, and I'm going to take that. <laughs> a no is a preparation for the yes. yes. I really do like that. But, yeah, I really feel like as a small business owner, like, we definitely should collaborate, like, you know, promote each other. And I feel like we don't promote yes. each other enough. Like, even though I say all the time, no one will ever promote you like you promote yourself. That is true. But it doesn't help to have five friends that post your stuff. Oh, and, yes. you know, We need the social media yes. support of say, the followers. Hey, I'm, I'm <laughs> scrolling and I see you and I'm not just going to pass it. I'm going to like it. I might comment. I might yes. share it. I might even tag somebody that might be, it might not be my thing, but you know, right. well, someone listen, else might like You it. were coming on to the show today and you, I noticed on your uh, Instagram page, made a, you, you talked about it. So that's important. Thank you so much. No, no problem. I like to make my own little, I don't know who I think <laughs> I am. I like to make my own little flies and stuff no, because I want people to know. You're representing yourself, the brand and what you're about to uh, enter. So that, that as that's a teachable moment. Any young artists out there, you are, you, you got to take the brand to the next level. Right. You got to bring their exposure right. on that. So that's what you did. And I was, uh, I, I want to say thank you. Oh, no problem. <laughs> Anytime. <laughs> Anytime. It was cool. I, you know, I did it late last night and I'm like, let me do this before I go to sleep because. Well, being that we're talking about, we're touching up social media and beauty fest, uh, beauty expo. But your glam fest is happening right now you're promoting this and you're also promoting it online on social media right. how do you find the social media has been helping you in your business it's been helping um i don't like when they take the money on my account for the paid promotions of course oh, but what? yeah because you have paid promotions like i pay for facebook ads to be oh, sponsored oh. and instagram ads to be sponsored oh that's another thing investing in yourself and your oh, business is very important okay. but um talk about that you we pay for promotion for certain things because mm -hmm. we feel like, you know, more exposure. it's going to be more exposure. It might be 77 people I don't follow, but because they're in that genre of makeup or whatever a hashtag is, they'll see the post and they may not like it or right. they may not, you know, comment at that time. But when you keep sharing it, damn, why keep seeing this post? What is this? Let me click and see. Now they click, they've come to your page. You know, I like this. I think I'm going to go. Yeah. And that's how that all happened. So mm -hmm. I like social media. Social media has been great um, promotion. I mean, you still got to put in the footwork. I wish right. I could sit home and just talk from behind you my gotta phone. You got to be out there. But you have to be out there. You have to get that that real connection with people. Like, they had to force me this year to be like, okay, you have to make a drop, like, video with your face. People need to Ooh, understand yes. that it's not just a logo because and sometimes uh, people be hide behind the brand yes because I, they don't want to be the face of the brand i would really love to do that i'm just going to be really honest i would love to hide but i can't <laughs> it, it's not working. no you are the face of the <laughs> brand. it's not working i would love to hide but it, it's not it hasn't been working no so, this yeah. is all beauty <laughs> and you want to bring that out to the public so now is there anything else that we want to talk about in terms of glam fest and your event coming up here in Brooklyn, New York, as I mentioned before, it's going to be at the Black Lady Theater. Yes. So uh, anything else that your guests and people who are thinking about coming out to your event should know? Um, both of my other brands will be there that I'm excited about. Okay. Um, Bowtie Nation will be in the building. And also, my um, I have a makeup brush cleaner too called Glam Magic. Oh. That we just launched in July, so that'll also be on sale at Glam Fest. So I'm excited about that. Okay. Um, also, you can get the, you can pay at the door, but what I would suggest is to get your tickets online now because if you pay at the door, it's going to be more money. Okay. Um, if you go to glamfest19.eventbrite.com, you can get the tickets. Um, there's a package rundown. Make sure you click the description so you know what you're buying. I've seen people okay. always read the yes, best. read the yes, details. Read the details. <laughs> All their events. And then for everybody that's kind of confused, so Glam Fest is from October 12th through October 13th. It's two days. October 12th, the doors open at 4. We're ending around 9. And then October 13th, our doors open at 2. And we're ending around 9 o'clock. So, okay. that's, you know. Well, I have to tell you, um, this has been fun. Yes, it has been, it's been real fun. I think we talked about a lot of things. And... Uh, I, I think one thing I want to talk about last is um, 
your la what are your last words for young women of color coming up into the beauty industry? What are your key words that they should always remember? Um, I don't know. <laughs> um, just keep going. And, and what is that word that you vibe off to stay motivated in what you're doing and making things happen as you're moving forward in your career, in your passion? Hmm, let me think about this. Yeah. Um, and tell us about that t-shirt you're wearing. Yes, ask me about <laughs> Gwen Plus 2019. So if you guys have any questions, you can ask me. Sometimes I forget that it's on. So when I'm in the street, people be like, hey, what is Gwen Plus? Hello, sir, who are you? Yes. Let's go down. So now I forget said, that. Ask me. Yeah, I forget I have this shirt on. It was made for Circle of Sisters because we okay. went there and we gave out Can they get this shirt online? So or? no, we'll have, this will actually be launched 2020 for Glen Fest 2020. Okay. So we'll have Glen Fest shirts um, next year for 2020. Um, as far as the word, yeah, what's that word? Besides <laughs> money, because I like money a lot, but um, I think purpose is something that keeps me very motivated and you know going. Because sometimes, even now, sometimes I don't always know my purposes, and then I kind of always find myself in this lane where it's just like, oh, okay, okay, this is, and I feel like if you remember what your purpose is. Or what it is that you stand for you can never go wrong like it'll always come almost like second nature to you because it's something that you you've put your heart into and you know this is what you're supposed to be doing listen everybody you heard it here first on brooklyn beauty television bbtv with our guest ashley b from glam fest beauty expo competition coming up 2019 in brooklyn yes and i'm gonna let you close and promo and now i know you mentioned that you wanted to do a little something for the oh, yes. viewers i'm not quite sure you're gonna be able to i don't know well, but we did kind of tuning in okay hey on instagram <laughs> so i want to give two free tickets away um the two free tickets would be for october 12th through the 13th for um general admission and I guess we can ask them a question and whoever answers Instagram. first. <laughs> Hi, Miss Davis.